Hey guys and gals, I'm Pal, and this is Nova, and welcome back to Pal's Play Wind Waker. In the last episode, we started off the game and found out that it's Link's birthday! Look at Link. Yay! Look at him. Look, look at Link. He's... I have no clue what age he is. He's, he's probably 10. He's, he's 10. kind of an abomination to nature. And this episode, <laughs> uh, well, also last episode, we got a telescope for our birthday, or at least we get to borrow one. And we looked at the sky, saw a giant bird in the sky. He had a girl in his in his talons. He dropped her after the pirate ship hit, it, hit him with a cannonball. And a bunch of stuff happened last episode. If you missed it, go back and watch it. It's kind of wacky. Go And the girl fell into the forest. Right. Uh there. The forest. Which is kind of... It's not, not really 3D. a model. It's kind of just a flat image. Anyway. Anyway. Yeah. Uh, this episode, we're going to find something to defend ourselves with so we can go rescue her, I guess, is the plan. Talk to the guy, because he's waving. Does he have anything new to say? We talked to him last time, but meh. That L targeting you just did has a wide range of uses, my boy. It's most certainly for if you just skip past him. Okay. You'd, he has nothing good to say. Stupid old man. <laughs> uh, I always wanted him gone. Uh, we always talked at like the the homeowners association, and we talked about him. He's he's gonna go pretty soon. All right. So we heard about Orca about how he is the guy who knows the ways of the Taekwon derp, and we're going to see what he has to say. Talk to him, or throw a pot at him. Grab a Ooh, pot. Okay. Throw a pot. I mean, they gave us the pots. It's clearly ammunition. <laughs> he actually blocked it. He has nerves of steel and eyes that will pierce your soul. And reflexes of... A lizard. Something, Talk to him. Talk to him. Anyway. <laughs> <laughs> Wait. You, see, you see my moves? You see my moves? Why won't you let me talk to him? Don't make me use my moves on you. Oh, what is the matter, Link? You have an urgent look about you. Has something happened? Whatever it is, from the look on your face, I suspect it is no laughing matter. What say you, Link? He doesn't say anything ever. Ah, have you come for some serious instructions in the way of the sword? Yes, sir, I guess. In case I didn't make it in, uh, unbelievably clear, Nova is in control of this episode, so yes. any mistakes will be blamed on her. Our first game over will be blamed on her. Very good. Your first lesson shall be the horizontal slice. Face me and press A or B. <laughs> Do not fear for your safety. <laughs> I'm ready for you. <laughs> no, for his safety. Whatever. Just hit him. <laughs> good. Keep coming at me till you hear me say... I caramba, I guess. Man, this guy's creepy. Here. Just hit him. He's like, no, I can't, I can't stand that last attack. Very good. Next is the vertical slice. P hold L to target me and press B. Keep swinging. Do it. Cut his face off. Oh, man. <laughs> Very good. Next is the thrust. L target, tilt the thing forward and press the button. Come at me. Thrust with your sword. I stabbed you. Very good. Keep on doing it. Man, he's in a corner. You're, you're having, you're having your way with him. Oops. <laughs> <laughs> Can that be a ringtone, please? In fact, get it wrong again. Get it wrong again. Hit him. <laughs> I love Link's scream there. It's, it's the best thing I've ever heard. Okay, just do what he wants. Next is the spin attack. Hold B briefly to build up your strength, then release it. Or you can just spin it in a circle. If you spin the control stick in a circle, then it will just instantly do a spin attack. Do it. Or hit him with it. Maybe. There you go. So you don't have to hold B. In fact, it's kind of stupid to hold B. Next is the parry attack. L target until you see A! Then quickly press A to perform a dis derisive, decisive, defensive strike. Okay. Wait for him Come to me, hit you with the stick, and then hit him with your, your sword. Very good. And again, L target and watch closely for A. So that's the new mechanic of this game. There are sword techniques, which okay. there were not in Majora's Mask. Okay, hold on. So when you're doing the parry attack, if you hold a control stick tilted when you do it, you will roll. If you don't, you will jump over the top of their head. Really? Uh-huh. Is that the, the, the factor? Uh-huh. I thought it was random. Do it again. Do it again, but don't uh, hold it. 
I did not know that. I don't think he's gonna come at me. He wants you to do it again, though, right? No. Oh, he said something else? Yeah, I don't even know what he said. Oh. Well, he'll say it now. You must perform a jump attack! Okay. okay. Man, you don't have to say it twice. Except he did. Come at me once more! Man, this guy's creepy. Like, what What does he do for a living? Does he just collect shark teeth? What does he do with the shark I think he, teeth? I think he carves stuff. Out of shark teeth? That's creepy. Creepy man. No, out of wood. And you can even see his ribs. It's very creepy. And yet, I sense a certain anxiousness in the sword you hold. An eagerness that goes far beyond the mere desire to be wielded on the fields of battle. I do not know what has happened. But I have faith in you. Somehow, I doubt you will misuse that sword. You may have it, Link. I give it freely. Take the bra blade, the braid. <laughs> take, take the magical braid with you. Link accepted the braid. Wield it with me. <laughs> nice accent. Link now has a ponytail. Use it wisely and carefully. You don't want to be to let down that kind of old man who's entrusted a braid to you. So he'll abrade us. Oh my. Since the olden days, this sword has been used to fend off evil. Its blade is infused with the desire to become strong and righteous. Be strong, Link. Wait, is his is his beard different lengths? It is. Might be. It, no, it's not. Oh, okay. No. Uh, that would have been brilliant, and I would have called the police and told them they did a good job. What are you doing? Keep okay. hitting him. Hit him. Hit him. Yeah. Kill him. Hey, Link. <laughs> You're drunk. Hold on. Hold you on. should really go home. No, 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 not yet, not yet. Kill, kill hit him again. Hit him again, really. Yeah. Hit him again. Awesome. <laughs> <laughs> uh, that's, that's a good Easter egg. Okay, <laughs> nice now, now roll into right the wall. There. Roll into the wall. There are a bunch of actually secrets in this room. The other wall. Other back wall. The one you're going. doing. I'm going. That one. No, no. Under, under the thing. That thing. Under the snow. Yes. Keep doing it. I thought there was a secret that you could do. Oh, okay. We'll target it and press A. I thought there was some secret that you could do here. What's that? The Knight's Crest? Does that intrigue you, young one? It is still too early to discuss such things with you. Aww. <laughs> You'll understand it when you're older. But if you haven't crossed ten of those, show them to me. Then I can tell you what they are and what they do. But I will only speak if you get ten of them. Because then you'll reach the chosen age to be to told what a belt does. <laughs> you idiot child. Okay, leave, please. Okay. We've spent too much time in this ramshackle house. This guy is dead to me. Now the fun can begin. Where are we going? Oh yeah, we're going to the thing. Uh, before we do, wait, 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 wait. No, we'll do that later. Never mind. Just go. Just go to the place. Okay. You have a sword. <laughs> Why not? I'm kind of jealous because I want to fight with the sword, but I'll I'll get to fight with the sword one day. When, when, I'm, you're, when you're old enough. When I'm old enough, I can understand what a knight's crest does. Ooh, talk to him. Talk to this man child. Did you hear that noise, Link? Did something happen? What was it? <laughs> oh, say, that is a fine sword you have there, buddy. Just look at that thing. You know you'd be doing me a big favor if you cut this dress for me. <laughs> this guy's name is Microsoft Sam. Don't you get dizzy from that? No. Oh. That must be in later you games. You get dizzy from something else, which I shall not name yet. Okay. Kill everything. Do we get something from doing the grass, or are you just doing you it? You get what you find. Oh. Well, leave it alone. We don't need it. Get the rupees and then leave. Fun fact, you can actually, uh, if you use the cheat codes or the Game Shark Genie stuff, you can actually, uh, hack your way onto that pirate ship and, spoilers, it will progress the story. And that's actually kind of cool. Okay, you have an obsession with grass. Um, yeah. Not sure if we've addressed this by now, but you have an obsession. Go to Grass Cutters Anonymous. <laughs> Read the sign, read the sign, read the sign. Okay. First. I love how excited you are to go everywhere. Okay, do that. Yeah, yeah, mm, yeah, all right. Okay. Fairy fountain, sight ahead. Increase your fortune. Fortune is in red because it was drawn with human blood. Is there anything blood. to see up there yet? There are flowers. I think the flowers actually give you a, a number of rubies, but we don't need that. No. 
There's stuff up there. There's like a platform. But we we want the goodness. Ah. Wait, is there a ruby down there? I think there is. Hang off of it. No. No, 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 no. That's not the one you'd land on. Hang off of it. Can you hang off of it? No, I lied. Good job. Uh, we'll be right back. Da 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 I have the tiger. Da da na 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 na. Hey guys, we're back. We're taking this rock with us. It was special. Hopefully he'll jump here. We'll name him Ted. Oh. Well, no, let's not call the rock Ted. Let's call it. Well, I I did. I have the tiger. Let's call it Rocky. No, Rocky. <laughs> Kill him. Nah, he's still alive. He's just on the bottom of the sea. Drowning. You're drowning, Rocky. That's why there's never a Rocky 14, because you drowned him. How many Rockies were there? 17. Were there? No, there, there couldn't have been 17. I, I'm pretty sure there were at least four. Wait, 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 wait. What? Look up. What? I saw something flashy. To the right. To the right. To the right. To the right, right, right. Never mind, it was a cloud. <laughs> Move on. <gasps> were there four Rockies? I'm pretty I sure there No, 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 no. What? The log. Oh, okay. Go through the log. Okay. We'll be, we'll sneak in stealth. Man. <laughs> My childhood coming back. We actually got stumped before the first boss of this game, so we just kept playing up to that point over and over again, so... Yeah, we couldn't defeat the first boss. So we would reset the game once we got to that point, and then play through the beginning again. I mean, to over be fair, and over and over. We were pretty young. Ah! Kill him! Whoa, he he knows <laughs> he knows the taekwondo, the taekwondo. Kill him, please. <laughs> <laughs> you you've been missing all these misses. Doe, I missed. Wait, 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 wait! He put, has something, maybe. Loot his pot. Oh, he's hey. alive. <laughs> How many times you two missed? Just like this. I'm used to the symphony uh, of death. Better swords that kill on the second hit. Like Skyward Sword. That's such a good game. I'm just gonna be comparing this game to Skyward Sword. Up, up, up. Read the sign. The the sigin. Read the sigin. Fairy fountain site. This spot marks the remains of an ancient fairy fountain. The legendary hero was said to come here after battle, so the fairies could ease his weariness. It was also said that wh whomever, who, whom, I don't know, met with the great fairy, lived here, was blessed with the great fortune because it known the fairy, the fortune. Thank you for that. You're welcome. All right. I, I do, I do book readings on Sundays. Good job. Thank you. Playing lava over there. Yeah. Yeah. Baby. Meh. Ah! <laughs> he, it's the eye of tiger. Okay, it's okay, the okay. The fight. These guys are so hard. To the change of our rivals, killing dudes and stabbing them through the I'm face invincible. and the Spin eye, to win. and we'll kill them and they will all die. Like tiger. This is way too. Far. No, no, get the treasure. Too late. Oh wait, that's the treasure. Never mind. And Link got the girl, and the game ended. I love the physics of this game. <laughs> like the, you go up before you go down. They they establish very early on that this is a cartoon, which is why most people didn't like it when it was announced. Wow, what's with that getup? Uh, back when we were younger, we didn't know what that word meant, so we, we we actually had discussions on that. No joke. Well, whatever. So where am I? Oh, that's right. That giant bird came and... Oh! Miss! <laughs> Miss Tetra! I give up! Spot I'll lay down my on. weapons! He's the best character. Oh, thank... Thank goodness you're safe! When I saw you get dropped on the summit, I thought you'd... For sure you'd... Summit? So that bird dropped me on top of a mountain. Well, wasn't that nice of it? Well, don't just stand there. Let's go. Time to repair our debt to that burden full. But, but, miss, what about the boy? Don't worry about him. Come on. He's my favorite. No joke. He's my favorite character. That is Gonzo. Gonzo. So awesome. <laughs> he 
he's a good human being. He's a gentleman and a scholar. Oi, big brother! I think the seagulls are following her because they want to eat her. That's my theory. Interesting. Not sure if that's accurate. See, this is proof right here. Brother! Oh, not again. I'll kill the seagull this time for good! What was his plan there exactly? Right? It's like, I'm just gonna jump off this cliff now, sprout wings and fly. <laughs> Ugh, stupid kid, get a hold of, your, of yourself. She's gone. There's nothing you can do. You dumb bird. And his vanguard of seagulls. <laughs> ruin every cutscene in this game. You are. What? You want to come with us on your ship? On our ship? Do you understand what you're asking? We're pirates. You know, pirates. That's spelled P-I-R-A-T-E-S. The terror of the seas. What do you? Uh, what do we get out of bringing some helpless little kid with us? I'll tell you what we get: a headache. I know you how you must feel with your sister having been kidnapped and all. But that doesn't really have anything to do with us, now does it? And how do you figure that? <laughs> I love this. I, I love his position here. <laughs> just, who, uh, just who are you? Uh, where do you get off butting in on someone else's conversation? Please. All I mean to say is that you big bad pirates, uh, that if you ha big bad pri pirates hadn't come to this quiet little island, that poor girl wouldn't have been snatched away by that bird. And just what do you mean by that? Just be quiet for a moment and I'll tell you. Now, as my work entails delivering letters, I spend much of my time traveling amongst the many different islands. As a result, I hear many thi things. In fact, I write all the tabloids. <laughs> Haven't any of you heard word that young girls have been kid getting kidnapped lately from all regions of the Great Sea? No matter. Whether you've heard it or not, that seems to be the case. Young girls with long ears like yours g are getting kidnapped, or have been getting kidnapped, and never be seen again. And unless my eyes fail me, that young girl who was just kidnapped from this island also has long ears, does she not? Much like you do, Miss Fe Fearsome Pirate. My point is that the bird mistook that poor girl for you, and that's why it grabbed her. And correct me if I'm wrong, but I believe it was young Link here who saved you from the monsters in the forest, wasn't it? I mean, maybe. I can... There's no evidence. <laughs> Is this true? Oh, and while I'm at it... Man, this is like Phoenix Wright up in here. <laughs> Phoenix Wright, Bird Edition! I may as well tell you that the bird that kidnapped both you and Link's sister has made its foul nest to the north, on the heights of the Forsaken Fortress. Forsaken Fortress? Isn't that the place where... So, what are you going to do? Under the circumstances, I don't think it would be unreasonable for you to give Link a little help, now would it? Hmph. I don't need your you to tell me that. Even if I were to consider it, lately, I've heard nothing but evil rumors about this Forsaken Fortress. You can't possibly mean to go there with nothing but that cheap little sword. That's not brave, it's stupid. I mean, come on! Even a simple little island like this has to have something that you could use as a shield. You know, something to protect yourself with. Anything? To tell you what, uh, if you come back with something like that, we'll let you stow away on our ship. Oh, and one more thing. Once we leave, you won't be coming back here for a while, so you better go say goodbye to your family while you have the chance. I don't want you getting all weepy-eyed and homesick on me. I'm pretty sure she said that thing about the shield just because she thought he couldn't find one, and then he couldn't come with them. True, although he could just grab the bark off the tree. She wasn't really concerned about his safety or Yes, now before we grab the shield, let's go do some of the other many different things that we can do on the island. Since Quickly go get all the hidden riches? Yes, okay. hidden traps. Uh, wait, 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 go to the right. Can we get on that t the top of that thingy? The bath. Yeah, I think so. I don't think you can. I think there's a secret way to do it. <laughs> Link's like, how do I get above this two-inch ledge? 
Rupee. Man, it's gonna be. It's gonna take all of my bodiness. Look at that face. <laughs> That's hilarious. Yeah, the the faces of this of this link are infamous for being epic and he awesome. He should have his own memes. Now hit hit R hit R hit R hit R and then move. So good. And then if you barely move the control stick, you can make, just make him look back and forth. <laughs> so good. <laughs> uh, okay, let's get the pot. Ah, <laughs> uh, Link's the champion among. No. Among people who waste riches. Dirty dog of a pot. I lost one rupee. Rupee. It's gonna take all of my bodiness, as I was saying, to keep myself from from referencing other Let's Plays. Yeah. It really is. Ooh, grass. Okay, go- no. Wait, if I jump on here- Huh! Barely. Okay. If this were Majora's Mask, you could do the flip- f The epic flips and jump? Like, man. <laughs> oh, yeah. Okay, first person. Dude, what is a Zelda game without for first person? You wanna know what it is? All of it. Link's crossbow training. <laughs> so, if we go underneath the house- We'll be led into this place where all the bodies are hidden. No. And in this chest is another body with an orange rupee inside the body. It was in the chest. Am I the only one that thinks it would have been cool to have a redead in here? Right? No, it wouldn't have been. It wouldn't have been <laughs> cool at all. Only if the redead had, like, special hair and it danced. What? I love those secrets in video games where it's like, it shows this random thing that's completely unrelated to the game, but it's awesome. Like in this one Minecraft custom map, there's actually like a gif of Link or something like that. It's really cool. Get the yellow rupee. Oh, we're at max rupees. Oh yeah, we are. Okay, well let's go to Beetle, because we have time this episode to go do stuff, so let's go to Beetle, because he's right there, just just chilling. Drinking up some of that some of that alcohol. Because he brews it himself. He brewed it even during Prohibition, because he's been around that long. I don't know what that was. Oh, a customer! Welcome to Freddy. Oh wait, sorry. Beetle's shop ship. <laughs> I deal in pretty much everything and anything. Do you have anything you don't need? If you do, show it to me. I'll pay top rupees for your. I thought that. I thought it was junkle. <laughs> <laughs> for your junkle. Or do you see anything else you'd like to buy? Oh, just use your controller to browse. We'll buy the bait bag, which Nova will take the liberty of doing. Yes. Because you can't buy bait unless you have a bag to put it in. Yeah, I mean, Logic. it's not like Link can't put it in his pocket. Or in his hat! He could put it in his hat. No. Yeah, he could. Okay, so we're going to get a couple things. We're going to get mostly all-purpose bait because that's very useful in this game. Do not play this game without getting all-purpose bait. No joke. It's awesome. Pardon me while I skip everything. And then we're going to get... Do we need a hoi pair? Yeah. We do? Yeah. Are you sure? Yeah. Why? We can get more rupees. Okay, okay. Okay, we'll get a hoi pair, just, just one or two, but mostly we're getting all-purpose bait because it is super, super useful. Thank you! Thank you. Man, his nose is okay. kind of scary. One hoi pair. And, is yeah, all-purpose really, bait. Is that really how you say it? Hoi pair? Yeah. Hoi? Well, what else would you say? Hoi-li-li? I don't know. It's a hoi li li, -li pair. But we're getting all-purpose bait, because we can pronounce that. We're gonna get as much as we can hold. Yes, that is true, because you need a lot of it in this game, if you want to 100% it, which we're going to be doing, by the way. In fact, that's some that's a good segue into something I want to talk about. Whether or not this Let's Play will be 100%, and what 100% means for this. Um, there are certain mechanics that I won't explain, because we haven't seen them yet, obviously, but the heart pieces, which are a staple of every Zelda game, I, we will be getting all of, and I will have annotations videos linking to each moment in the Let's Play where I get one, so it's easy to go back and refer and uh, use that as a reference. So we're going to be doing that. And I hope you enjoy them, because we worked very hard on them. Yes. Nova worked very, very hard. Nova's done the art for the past two Let's Plays, actually. Mm -hmm. Ryan hasn't really been involved because of college. Dirty Ryan. Okay, uh, where else? Um, are there any other secrets? Well, we're reduced in rupees now, so I can go get the others. Okay. What and others? I really like the secret in this house up here. It's my favorite. Now, before we before we leave the island, um, because we're not going to leave the island this episode. There's probably going to be one more. We're probably going to do that next episode. 
Because um, there's a lot of cutscenes. We might just go around and talk to a couple people, just for fun. We'd cut around and do that, uh, just so you can see what they say, because there's a lot of different dialogue in the game, and it's pretty good, actually. It adds It adds a lot of... To it adds game. character. <laughs> okay, so we can go up on this roof, jump into the roof of the roof attic. I remember when I discovered this and you were so amazed. Right? It's cool! And there are pots everywhere, and you can break them and get rupees! It's amazing how rich these islanders are. <laughs> I mean, how do they get so rich? I mean, we've gotten four rupees, five rupees, so it's not... I mean, our grandma's rich. We stole all her money. Ooh, there, a lot, there are a lot of pots. Now, we can't use our sword indoors because... The Zelda designers are terrible, terrible people, and they don't like that. They're trolls, is what they are. Yeah. Now, we can't actually get out the way that we came in, so we're going to actually be stuck in here, and we're going to rot away, and no one will ever know. Game over. No, no. No, you there's just, a exit. You have to go down... Where is it? Through there? You don't... Not, not yet. Yeah, I know. Hit the wall. Hit the wall. I, I will. Oh. <laughs> I'd love to see that. Just money rain down from the ceiling. Noise. Now we've gotten tw 18 rupees now. That's actually worth it. <gasps> Pick it up. Right. I Whoa. know how to play. Sorry, I forget. No, you could have broken the barrel with the barrel. Barrelception. Okay, jump down. And now we're in someone's house. Awesome. Now this is the house of those two snotty nosed kids. What was his name? Kerpakapi or whatever. <laughs> and then his brother Togapi. Or Togetic? I don't know. They're whatever their names were, they're, they're probably Pokemon related because we're playing Pokemon. The Legend of Pokemon Z. One more house. Okay, one more house, and Whee! then we're, we're basically just doing pre preliminary stuff before we leave. Because, like Tetra said, once we leave, we're not going to be back for a while. This is almost like the point of no return ish. Yeah, because then certain characters take over and they don't let you do anything but what they want you to do. Yeah, because they're socialist. <laughs> they're dictators. Like me. People yeah, very after much my like own you. Heart. I'm not really that dictator-ish. Uh, go through I there. know some people who would disagree. Well, dictator takes one to no one. Oh. I think that's it, actually. Mm -hmm. Okay, so let's go back to our house because there's something waiting for us. Oh, that's right. Yes. It's gonna get all sad. Yeah, because we need we need a piece of bark to progress. And where have we seen a piece of bark? Well, our grandma barked at us, but that's not the kind of barking I'm talking about. I'm talking about... <laughs> <laughs> I loved how he kind of glitched right there. It's like, I'm just gonna wiggle in place. <laughs> <laughs> that's the sound he makes. Wait, was there something over here? No, it's actually pretty... Yes! It's an impressive patio. I'd love to live in that house. This is a deck, not a patio. What's the difference? Patio is a block of cement, and deck is made of wood, and it's raised off the ground. Okay, I'll buy that. I thought you were just making stuff up, but no. I mean, you make stuff up all the time. No more than you. Anyway. What is it, Link? Please, tell Grandma what's troubling you. Now... Correct me if I'm wrong, but this is the first game that some of Link's relatives have appeared. No. No, no? he had an uncle in Minish Cap. Yes, that's true. Or was it... A yeah, yeah, that is true. But that's mm -hmm. technically not... That's not a Nintendo-made Zelda game. That's Capcom. All, But also Wind it's Waker... It's canon, though. M Minish Cap is, like, one of my favorite Zelda titles of all time. Favorite, um... It's so good. Game for a, a mobile device. Yeah. For okay. Sure. Uh, Telegram was troubling you. Where is Ariel? Is she still playing outside with the gulls? Wait, was this? Oh, the gall supposed... of that girl to be taken away with the gulls. Yeah, we were supposed to bring her back to the house, and we failed. Now Link will have to be sacrificed like his brothers. <laughs> what? Wonder why? Now what? Up the ladder. Go up the ladder. We need the we need the piece of bark so we can progress. Oh no, it's gone. Now that we can't find the bark, Ooh. it's time to face Grandma's bite. Oh! <laughs> Link? Is this what you've, you're looking for? Take it with you. Ah, we got the hero's bark. This is the legendary bark, said to have been used by the hero himself. Use R to defend yourself. You can also hold R to defend while L targeting. 
Oh, Aw, Mom, I didn't music. mean to call it bark. <laughs> I guess it's true. Ariel- or Grandma, not Mom. <laughs> Ariel really has been kidnapped, hasn't she? What kind of monster could take such a sweet young child? It is pretty sad. I won't- I won't belittle that. But also, this game's a good game, and it's meant to be taken humorously. <laughs> Except for that part. Yeah, the beginning's a little bit sad. But now he's left the house, But the rest and... of the game is just full of humor and mischief. <laughs> He'll never see his grandma again. <laughs> she'll be put on Medicare. Oh. <laughs> and she'll be put in a home. I guess she is in a home. Alright, so now that we have the shield, uh, we're going to end it off... What are you doing? <laughs> I hate mailboxes. They ruin my life. Uh, Link is a tormented child. Go look at the crabs while I'm talking. Okay. Uh, now that we have the shield, next episode we're going to be showing the shield to the pirates, showing that we got more than just a piece of bark, and now they're forced to take us with them on their journey. Man, that's a delicious looking crab. Crabs taste good. Uh, and next episode we're going to be doing that so thank you so much for watching uh and if you enjoyed this episode please comment and if you didn't enjoy this episode then comment and tell me how i can make the next episode so that you would like it <laughs> uh you might you might start a cutscene there no uh <laughs> i release new episodes of wind waker tuesdays thursdays and saturdays and nova and i will see you guys next time for another hell's play wind waker uh <laughs> this is gonna be a drunk let's play <laughs> we're gonna act so drunk because it's fun and link acts drunk so we must act drunk did you say goodbye oh <laughs> see you guys then <laughs> <laughs> it's like i'll i'll see you in your dreams <laughs>